The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 220 pounds, Johnny Munoz. Guys, there is so much intrigue here heading into this fatal four-way match. That's what you get, Michael, when you have four superstars who can legitimately win this thing. And his opponents, first, from Windsor, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 178 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for our fatal four-way match. And one of these superstars will walk away from here with plenty to brag about, while the other three will likely be wondering what went wrong for them here tonight. And from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 176 pounds, Ray V. Nick. A big time fatal four-way match coming up here, guys. Which means, believe it or not, we're going to be sending away three of these superstars with a loss here tonight. From Japan, weighing in at 164 pounds, the soldier. Fatal four-way action coming up in Byron. What should we look out for in this one? This is one of those matches, Michael, where anything can happen, and it usually does. The only thing I know for sure is that the referee will have his hands full in this one. The four men in the ring are set. One of the most chaotic contests a superstar can compete in is a fatal four-way. Anything can happen, and the match can be over in an instant. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Harsh impact. Great agility. What a stomp. Good grief. He's got the shoulders down. Plenty of fight left. Yeah, this early, no chance. What a drop kick right to the back. What a stomp. Good grief. Uh-oh. He's taking some offense. It'll be interesting to see how he responds here in this four-way environment. At this point, it's still anybody's match, oh, Cole, but he's got to be careful not to take too much more punishment here if he wants to be the one walking away with the win. 
He wants no part of the outside. a step quicker it looks like and the DDT since there are no disqualifications in a fatal four-way match a superstar has to be aware of the fact that if they're in an elimination fatal four-way match someone who was eliminated can come back for retribution and it's all legal so you can eliminate an opponent and they can interfere in the match later and there's nothing anyone can do about it. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Oh, nasty impact. There's a pin now. Myron, you touched on something earlier that's worth repeating. If you're a superstar competing in a fatal four-way elimination match and a competitor is eliminated, they can look to settle a score and affect the outcome of the match later. That's always a possibility in a fatal four-way match because of the no disqualification stipulation. Michael, that's what I like to call an occupational hazard. We saw an example of that in 2016 during the fatal four-way elimination match to determine the number one contender for the WWE Championship. The Miz was eliminated from the match, but let's say he had a major influence on the outcome of the contest. Just ask Dean Ambrose. Something that a superstar must remember in a fatal four-way match is that there are no countouts and no disqualifications. I love the sound of that. Just think of all the possibilities. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, a flying forearm on the mark. Corey, as you mentioned before, I know how fond you are of contests that have no count. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Ooh. Look at that tremendous ring presence. Very impressive. Uh-oh. He might nail it. I'm not sure how much he has left. He's looking at it. When this guy's on, this might be it. Oh, my. Nice. Shut it down. And executed with such amazing grace. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. German's shoulders down, isn't it enough? This is what makes him one of the best in the business. This is not where you want to be. This could be huge. Here he comes. line! Can he fit? Oh, close line! But he's got to capitalize. Well, you do your modeling career. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. More often than not, that marks the end of the match. Beautiful technique. This is it. This just ain't going to do it. Looks like he has other plans here. I think he was just looking to soften him up a little here. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Keep your eye out. Look out! He could do it here. Got him. Big victory in the fatal four-way. That match deserves another look. Here we go. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. This was one of those matches that had flashes of brilliance, but never quite lived up to all the hype. Good match overall, though. Here is your winner, Johnny Munoz. The referee's three count ends this one. And there's your winner, folks. To get the pinfall victory over such a high-quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. And it'll be interesting to see the ripple effects this win has in the weeks to come.